extraction investigation. A 31-year-old woman who admits to having sex with a 13-year-old boy hmm. and then becoming pregnant with his hmm. child won't face any jail time under a plea deal with prosecutors. Interesting. Adam Serrano gave birth to a baby boy. She admitted to having sex with that 13-year-old. The victim's mother, who we're not going to identify in this story, tells us she is not happy with this deal offered to a woman she says ruined her son's life. Okay. What's the deal? That's you know, what I want to know. And you do and you do what? Well, they're probably going to do probation. They're probably going to do some supervised. You're on an offender's list. I didn't know you could be on an offender's list and have a child. First thing first. Am I the only one that thinks that's kind of weird? Imagine being put on an offender's list and also being allowed to keep your kid. Is that a thing? It's a thing. I mean, if the offender is a woman. Apparently. I may be unaware. I actually don't know how this shit works. I don't know how this shit works either. That's, That's crazy. crazy. I didn't even think of that. There's plenty of offenders. I'm pretty sure who do get to keep their kids. Yeah. They okay. do have kids. Okay, so, yeah. First thing first, you have to understand one thing that pops up in their mind. It was sexual assault even though if there was intercourse and there was a kid. Because uh, in the law for certain people, for certain states, for certain places, uh, it's only men that can, <clears throat> great. It's only men that can, you know, and since it was consensual or whatever. Wait, wait, you just said all that, but I actually don't even know. Is that true? Are you sure? In some place, well, because of, of the way the law is made, because it's written that it's a penis. Right, but it's not, that's not like that in America. I, it depends on the places. Or I think it's like penetration is what they define as. And by but penetration by what? Because if it's because if it's not the member of so if it's fingers, it's not going to be considered great. Because if it's if it's fingers, it's not great. It ha for some in some places, it has to be penis. Okay. You know what I mean, I'll take it your word for be, it. But or you could you could change. No, no, I'll take your word for it. It's fine. Keep going. Depending on where you are, so it, it yeah. could change. So there's that. So it was a saw. Mm -hmm. Like if she would if it was a man doing that, it would have been a whole lot of uh, charges. Yes. So and a nigga be in jail. And then after that, no I, 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 I don't want to give it the whole man and switch the birth, but bro, this is no jail time is kind of crazy. That's the part where it's kind of like okay, no jail time, probation, supervised, uh, whatever, and still having the kid is is fucking is a mess, bro. Yeah. Like I can't. I mean, you have to imagine. 13 year olds at school will he's high pb and jelly at, at lunch tim how's your son that's wild you don't even as make... a 13 year old like that's crazy to it's be a nuts. dad yeah. that's 13. you don't even eat your own you don't even you don't even do your own lunches but you're gonna eat your teacher's lunch that's crazy oh shit this was the ultimate survival food of our forefathers cooled and sewn into bison hide bags weighing 90 pounds it was an ex you know what else? 13. If, if she gets to keep the kid, think about this. Think about this. <laughs> think about that. That being said. That being said. The grandma wants to see her grandchild. Mm -hmm. She got to visit her child's grandpa's. Back in Barbados, eating coconuts by the water. <laughs> I was pick, picking coconuts in Barbados. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You're foul. So, that being said, coconuts by the... <laughs> I don't get that the being reference. said, um, that's crazy though. Uh, this is actually a serious topic, but I just can't. Yo, this <laughs> is fucking it's, wild. No, no, think about it though. You want to see your grandchild? You got to go see your child's rapist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Your you child wants to see their kid. They got to work out an agreement. Which is well, it's gonna be what's on the grandma because she's gonna be the one who's gonna have to supervise yeah. middleman. But uh -huh. that is insane. She has fucked up this kid's life in so many ways. Mm -hmm. Forget childhood. It's like. He's a kid having to raise a kid. Yeah, he's kid. He's officially. But yeah. he's not even ready to raise a kid. Oh, can't even raise himself. Like, he's never gonna go through that eighteen to twenty-four year old phase where he's figuring life out. He got. Nah, he got to be now. a parent right away. It's now. It's already one crazy thing to do that to to not even wear protection, to not even do that, like to to fuck up his life that way, and for her to get zero jail time. Zero. My girl, you are consequences. Sick and demented, my girl. Zero consequences. There's issues there. There's issues. She fucked up his life. She fucked his life up. And whoever the prosecutor is, like, this is a smoking gun. She's too old. You got the you got the sperm. 13. This is why I suspect. I think the reason why they did the plea deal, and this is my suspicion, is because who's gonna take care of the kid? Yeah. I can't go to jail. I can't go I can't birth the kid in jail. You could. And I can't I've seen that. 
can't uh, to get like I gotta that's, do that again. That's the only thing because if this was a woman, I don't think they would. If this is a man who had done this, I don't think they would have shown them anything. With no, it. of course not. So, no, I think it's what? because of that. <laughs> What? She is not happy with this deal offered to a woman she says ruined her son's life. I feel like my son's robbed of his childhood. Now he's having to be a father. He, he's a victim, and he's going to have to live with that for the rest of his life. This mother says watching her son struggle with the reality. The sandals is pissing me off. He now faces breaks her heart. What has this been like for your son? Um, it's caused him a lot of depression. He's um, shut down a lot. Now she questions why this woman won't face prison time. Uh, I feel like if she was a man. She fire. Oh, man, I hate to say that. She's a predator. Let me not. I take that back. She's not fire. She's she's a sick individual. And he was a little girl. Sick it individual. would definitely be different. They would be seeking incarceration. What? And seeking? The nigga would be, in, he'd be dead booked already. <laughs> what? The accusation has him walking out with his face plastered everywhere. Niggas would be in the comments, you fucking sicko. You're disgusting. You deserve to be hung. Ah, crazy shit. I feel like Come because on, she's sir. a woman, they're not. They're having compassion for her because she was pregnant. But I don't think they take into play again. She was pregnant by a child. You know, that child was created from a sexual abuse. Under terms of the plea deal the suspect signed off on, she'll be required to register as a sex offender. And the judge could sentence her to 10 years to life of sex offender intensive supervised probation. But Serrano will avoid any jail time since the DA's office dropped the original charges to a lesser charge that does not come with mandatory jail time. What should other parents do? <laughs> Don't trust anybody, honestly. I mean, you can't trust anybody now. Damn. The victim's family says they are looking for the next step. Oh, so it's the victim's the family. Because the prosecutor is not trying to do that. They no. ain't trying to do shit. I wonder, I mean, I get it. I mean, I don't get it, actually. I wonder why. I think it's because she's, she's a woman. I, I, and all that, but like, damn. But the thing that happened is, is, is if she's not, if she doesn't get custody of the kid, Get your ass, walk your ass to jail. Walk your ass to jail. No, they're not changing the plea deal. No, they're, they're, not, they're not gonna change they're that one between. I'm just no, saying. No, no. The victim's family says they are looking for the next steps in this case, and they'll actually ask the courts to give custody to the 13-year-old of this baby. Adam oh. and Lindsay, what we do know is that Serrano has a uh, hearing coming up in May where she will learn how much probation time she'll have. Currently, Serrano has full custody of the baby. Back to you. That is crazy. This story might be the most crazy story I think I've read on this channel. Imagine being able to break someone, get out of jail because you're pregnant, and also get to keep the baby as an offender of underage. Ooh, baby, Freakery. baby, it's a wild Yeah, I don't know. Boy. This is this is wild, my nigga. I've never heard of no shit like this. This is dead some wild shit, bro. Son life is clipped. You a dad, nigga. Any, 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 any. any thoughts? What is the interaction gonna be like for the child, for him and for for the child and the mother now? Like, are they gonna have be able to have a relationship? Like, I wonder what that's gonna be like. <laughs> Go ahead, hit him. <laughs> it's like, what do you want me to say at this point? There's, there's so much things and so much depth in this. This is the fact that she's a woman, yeah. Plays, plays, that plays a part. significant part, the obviously. Like, yeah, she, she has good staff custody of the kid, a whole ass offender. It's like sometimes these story makes you think, am I the only one that's saying and see that there's a problem in there? They don't see the problem. I think they, they see it, they just don't care. Okay. Yeah, I don't think they care. What you looking for? She was needing more info. It's just crazy. Now we don't know what the what was the relationship like. I assume it was a teacher, right? Teacher, captain. But they didn't mention that, so it's probably not even a, a teacher. So yeah, I think I think if I'm not mistaken, the story was something about like she was a uh, shorty was uh, um, what is that lunch lady or some shit like and that. When the mother said, "Yo, she got she had neck tattoos." I don't think she's a teacher. Yeah, and then she said, "You can't she got neck you can't you can't you can't trust nobody." So it's possible that it's someone close to the. It generally is. Yeah. But generally, someone close. It's just, I don't know. I can't. I, I don't know. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Run that shit back. Her name is Serrano. Okay, they didn't say the name of the kid. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, I thought they at some point. I think they're probably just not mentioning. Yeah, he's a, he's, he's, he's a kid. They're not going to mention that. This is crazy. Let me know how y'all feel about this, man. Obviously, if the roles reverse, niggas would get this nigga the death penalty, he'd be cooked. But 
and even what uh priest said earlier about certain things being grief and certain things not certain penetrations and shit like that like obviously it's not grief it's just sexual assault or just assault for a shorty which is kind of crazy man laws is, is written too. laws is written like on some shit man some shit